If you've got a drum loop that's an important part of a project, you're probably going to want to separate the kicks from the snares and the hi-hats so you can make separate adjustments to volume, EQ, effects for each. So here's a quick way to do that. First, let's create two new audio tracks. We'll label this one snares and this one kicks. Now let's highlight the region and I'm going to use a custom key command here, Command Option Shift T. And that's going to slice at transients or separate each sound. You can create your own key command for this by opening up the key commands, typing into the search bar slice at, and we'll see slice at transient markers. That's the one we want. And you can just type into this box the key command you want to use. This is really the best way to access this command. So now let's take a listen to this loop. I want to find all the snares and they all will look kind of the same. Here's one and here's one. So I've got all the snares and I have the snare track highlighted. So now I can use another key command, which will be control shift T and that moved the selected regions down to the highlighted track. So it moved all the snares down to the snare track. Now let's do the same for the kicks. I'm gonna highlight the kick track, then I'm gonna go up and find the kicks in our loop. So here's one. They'll all kinda of look the same. And now that I have them all highlighted, we'll try the same key command, Control Shift T and that moved all those down to the kick track. Okay, so let's solo the kicks. So we've got a little bit of cleaning up to do. So let's highlight all three tracks. And now we'll go to the fade out box and we'll type in two. That will create a small fade for each one of these regions on all of these tracks. Now let's take a listen. So we've got clean kicks now and we've got clean snares and clean hats. Matter of fact, let's rename this top one hats and perks. Once again, take a listen. So there you have it. You can now level, EQ, apply effects to the kicks, hats, snares, all separately, so they can fit better into your project. Try it out, let me know what you think.